In this video, we are going to create yet another admin page. We are going to call this page the post in collection page. Right, so I'm going to show you what this looks like on the finished project. If you click on the collections item on the left menu bar on the, on the completed project, you'll be taken to a page where we list all the collections on our website. Against, against each collection, we have a post link. When you click on that link, it will take you to this page where you can curate the articles that you want to appear under that collection. For example, if you go to the user facing, the user facing part of the project, you're going to see these carousels. This is basically what we call the collection. And this page essentially just gives us a, a way to select which articles we want to feature under these collections. So all these articles you see on the table to the right are the articles that belong to this collection. And then on the right, on the left here, we have a list of all articles available in our database. So we can add new articles and remove articles. And when we are satisfied with the list we have come up with, we can click save and all those articles will be saved under that um, collection. So it is basically uh, the same as what we have for the related post page. And also I'm going to be simplifying this collections page the same way I simplified the related posts page. This manage collections button isn't required because we already have a link here on the sidebar just for that. And then here there's no need in writing this title at the top. I'm going to move it to be the title of the right column because that's where we have posts that are already that have been assigned to the collection. Okay? So because of this similarity, I'm just going to copy this related posts page and use it for the post in collection page, making the necessary um, modifications. Okay, so let's go to our code base and open the admin folder. I'll open the post folder where we have the related post file. And I'm going to open that file related posts.html and copy all the code inside it. Okay. Then I will open the collections folder still under the admin folder. And I will create a new file called collection posts.html and paste that code inside it. I will then scroll to the top and start modifying. The title tag is going to say posts in collection or we could say manage posts in collection. The navigation bar is going to remain the same. The sidebar is also going to remain the same. The all posts table is also going to remain the same. The only thing that's going to change is the related posts colon. Um, we are going to change it from related posts to posts in collection. Okay, I'm going to make sure uh, the closing comment for this section also says post in collection and the title of the small box here should be post in collection and then the collection that was selected to get to this page that is the collections the collection whose articles we are curating will be this link that we see at the top of this table so this should be the name of the collection on our new collection posts page. So let's say uh, we'll hard code best of 2022 as the collection whose uh, articles we are curating. And then we scroll to the bottom of the table and the save button should now say save posts to collection. Okay. And I think that's that's all. If we refresh, or rather if we open that page on the browser, it is under the collections folder and it is called uh, collection underscore posts.html. So if we visit it, this is what it looks like. So for the related posts, when you clicked on the article, it took you to the details page or the post uh, details page where you can read the article. 
and then as for the collection posts page when you click on that collection whose articles you are um you are selecting it will take you to this uh let me show you it is going to take you to a page like this right so it's basically a page that lists all the articles in a particular collection for the user to explore them all right so the two pages the related post page and the post in collection page they look very similar and yet they perform their actions very very effectively and i also like the simplicity of the page okay so that's it for this video i'll see you in the next one